So you want to create your own VTuber avatar using Canva? I got you, boo. In this free VTuber character winter edition! You can download these assets and use them on your own stream. If you want your character's mouth to be lip synced to your voice, download Honk. That's what I'm using. All of the links are in the comments below. First, you're gonna go to canva.com and create a new design. I chose to create a square 1000 by 1000 canvas, but you can pretty much choose your own size. I wanna create a snowman, so what I'll do is look for snowballs. But you wanna look in photos and not graphics, because what you're gonna end up with is this, but when you export it, it's gonna look all weird and there's gonna be like more than a hundred layers to them. So you wanna choose a photo. So I'll choose this big snowball right here and just resize it and create the snowman's body. Just gonna duplicate the layers and stack them together. And then to create the buttons, I'm just looking for some coal. So what I wanna do is remove the background and there's a really easy tool for you to use in Canva doing that. Just one simple click, bam. Background removed. So I'm just gonna resize them, remove the background after duplicating the image, and just rinse and repeat. Next step, I want to add some eyes to the snowman. We're gonna choose an eye like this. I just wanna crop this image and remove the background. And then we're gonna resize it and, and add a pair of eyes to our snowman. Next up, I want a hat. So I'm gonna proceed with doing the exact same thing I did with the other stuff. For the nose, I want a carrot, for sure. But what I wanna do as well is erase those leaves. So what you can do after removing the background, you can click on erase and erase the parts that you don't want to use. Resize the carrot, place it as a nose, bam, you're done. Next up, some arms. So I'm gonna look for twigs, remove the background, resize, place the arms. And you know how it goes. Just duplicate it, add a second arm. Next up, I wanna look for a scarf. Once again, look in the photos. So remove the background to that photo as well. And you'll be able to erase the parts that you don't want on that scarf to make it fit on your snowman or whatever character you wanna use. I'm just gonna move some of the items around because I want the buttons to be visible. Next, I wanna add some snow to my snowman. So I'm gonna resize that, place a little bit of snow right there and maybe add a little accessory to his hat so i'm gonna grab some mistletoe remove the background resize it place it on the hat and bam got a hat next thing you want to do when you're done is export this image but because on canva you can't export any psd file you'll need to export this in a pdf Grabbing that PDF, you're gonna wanna go to photop.com. Open your PDF file in it. You'll see now that your PDF is divided in multiple layers and that's exactly what we need. I want to just adjust the snow a little bit so I'm gonna erase some of it. Next, you wanna go to file, save as PSD and save it wherever you need on your computer. You're gonna drop that file in the software of your choice. So you'll see you have your VTuber character, they come in multiple layers. So what I wanna do is just be able to export the main body. So make those layers visible. You're gonna save each layer as a PNG and export it with a transparent background. And you're gonna save that in your folder. Next step you wanna take is make your eyes blink. You're gonna grab your eyes layer and merge them together. And next step, you're gonna duplicate this layer make the bottom layer invisible, use the top layer to erase the eyes to make it seem like they're blinking. Now you got blinking eyes. Export those layers as PNGs as before and repeat. You're gonna grab those images and place them in your snowman folder. You're gonna copy this layer and put it in your honk folder. But first, you need to create a new character folder. So go to honk, make a new character, and name that new folder snowman or whatever you're building. Open up your images folder and paste your snowman folder in there. The last thing we'll need for that snowman is basically your lips to be able to lip sync while you speak. So you can grab any of the lips in the honk folders from any characters. Some of the characters have really good lips shapes. Um, some others are really simplified. 
you're gonna grab each individual mouth shape and copy and paste it in your snowman folder. The next step that you're gonna take is grab every single PNGs in that folder and place it in this specific location. It has to go in characters, snowman, images. Next up, open hunk. We're gonna build a snowman. Choose your character. You're gonna create a new layer with the base. And just keep adding the parts to it. So the arms, the eyes, the hat, and you're gonna reorder those layers together. So the hat should be on top of your layers, the eyes to the scarf, the body should be at the bottom. Next up, we'll add the mouth. So grab your silent shape or neutral one, place it where you need, and we're gonna assign every mouth shape to their sounds. This step should be super straightforward. Next, you're gonna make your eyes blink. So click on the eyes and you'll see a blink option. Click it, choose your blink eyes. And if you click outside of the program, you'll see that your snowman should now be blinking. Next, we're gonna click on the eyes and have them move whenever you move your mouse. So click on the eye icon, select look box and the distance. You can play with that distance until you're satisfied. And now you have it, the eyes move with your mouse. Next up, we're gonna be super fancy and make some items rotate whenever you speak. So we're gonna click on that carrot and then click on rotates on speech. We're gonna click tiny bit. You can experiment with this as well. Place the rotation pivot wherever it should be rotating. You can repeat with the arms and there you have it. Your own snowman PNG tuber, free to use. It's in the comments if you wanna use it. It's super easy to install it, especially if you have Honk. I have a video for you to watch explaining exactly how you do this. And thank you so much to the patrons on my Patreon for supporting what I do. You get behind the scene access, early previews on videos, and a lot of other options for you to choose from. And also, don't forget to download Honk. I've been using it for months and I've been hella happy. Thanks, boo. Don't, Don't forget, forget to, to like, like and subscribe. subscribe.